I was scrolling through Facebook today and I saw a video that was pretty upsetting and I felt the need to voice my opinion on it as a rider in the Sauron community. It's slightly graphic in nature so viewer discretion is advised. Let's check it out. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Are you okay, buddy? So, just setting the scene, we got a sir on here on the ground. We've got an injured rider and what looks like a trail here in Southern California. I, I, I got him on video. Are you okay, buddy? Oh, that was fucking crazy, bro. Can you talk? Oh, can you talk? The rider on the ground's not responsive. Bad sign. <sighs> Let me run that back really quick so you guys can appreciate this. Okay, so this is the guy who caused the accident. He's the Sauron rider. He's the bad guy in this video. He's picking up his bike, hitting the throttle. Like a total beginner, he's hitting the throttle, picking up the bike off the ground. If, if you just got your bike, sure, you know, I did that mistake as well this guy should not like get this man off the sauron this man should not be on public trails if he's hitting the throttle picking up the bike that's like the most basic mistake N just imagine how he actually rides the bike if he's doing this when he's not even on it Anything working. are you supposed to have those things here can you feel this your, your legs and you're, you're okay with your legs Try to fold your knees. Uh, are you supposed to have those here in the road or what pick your arms up over your head He's not being right, responsive at all. Yeah. Red flag. <laughs> More concerned about way, the bike is, than the guy that's on the ground right dude, now. Fucking something out, dude. No one is. It's stay time, my friend. Oh, yeah. Hey. Yeah, he's uh, uh, hey. They're illegal. Hey? Eh? You don't let it happen. Either. They're illegal, right? Yeah, but it's not. Hey, we, we got an emergency over here. Uh, where are we going by the dog park? Hey, 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 my friend. Hey, 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 hey. He's out. Hey. So obviously the mountain bikers know they're not going to catch him. None of them are really chasing after him. But what a coward. Oh, my God. Uh, I, the video speaks for itself. This guy's just making us all look so bad this is exactly why park rangers don't want sirens sirens at public parks because they do dumb shit like this and make us all look terrible let's keep watching now hey, hey. hey you follow that guy where he's going <laughs> fucking dumbass no, like, he hey sing it away sing it away Fucking dumb man. I knew he was gonna take off, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. I knew he was gonna take off. It's good to see there's at least some people there to witness this and, and help out the guy on the ground because he's not looking good. I got him on video, way. Eh? I got him on video. Fucking dumb man. There's a park. There's a right there. Are you okay, buddy? No? We're on the fire road, actually, on the fire road about a mile. Can you take off your helmet or are you good? You want to take off your helmet? Let me help you out, dude. You good? Okay. Got it. Are you good? I think usually you don't want to do that because that puts a lot of pressure on the neck. I think um, usually when you, you see accidents like this, you just want them to stay as still as possible until you get EMTs on the scene. I might be wrong, correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think they should have taken his helmet off. You want some water, dude? dude he broke my jaw, bro. His jaw is like, jaw is yeah, yeah, I saw the whole thing keep out him so hard. He's like head yeah. It was yeah, bad. That guy shouldn't be riding this thing at that speed. He took out, dude. Broken jaw. Broken jaw, worst injury, probably the injury I'm the most afraid of. If you break your jaw, they have to wire your teeth shut for six months. You have to eat through a straw for six months. Not to mention the physical therapy after that to get the jaw movement back. Uh, broken jaw is the worst. I mean, I'm just imagining, like, what if this was my dad? My dad mountain bikes. What if he was out just enjoying himself on a trail and this dickhead comes 
50 miles an hour around the corner hits him breaks his jaw and now he's eating through a straw for six months like and, and then the sarong guy doesn't even have the dignity to stay around he just dips i think it's clear why i felt the need to make a video about this because this makes us look so bad like the entire e-bike community not even sarong so fucking dumbass he's a known um known guy that so just 50 miles proud and see on this freaking fire road. Dude, I... Lucky had the full face on huh? okay. him. my jaw, bro. Uh, the location, um, okay, if you can get the, one of the amp, the, like, paramedics to meet there off the Fabriconte and Extremo, I can, I can meet them right there and I can show them, like, the right exactly. Or, yeah. Yeah. You want me to, uh, yeah, I can meet them right there at that corner. How are you feeling, dude? Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna leave some Advil here for you if you wanna take some more. <laughs> this man does not need Advil. Get this guy some Oxycodone. Get this man some Percocet. Get this man some cannabis. Advil, I'm dead. Advil doesn't even help headaches. This man just broke his jaw, but it, it was a nice gesture, I guess, to, to offer the Advil. Uh, that made me laugh the first time. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Dude, that motherfucker took off a Kimball, leave it. That motherfucker took off. Se fue, wey. Si, I got his fucking face. Let me save the video, wey. So, that is the video. It's pretty blurry. It's hard to identify who the Saron rider was. To my knowledge, he has not been identified yet, but people are trying to find out who he is. I think he should be held accountable. I'm only imagining if the victim was my dad getting his jaw broken and then the assailant just leaves in a hit and run, I'd be livid. And I am livid watching this. I think it makes the entire Sauron and e-bike community look terrible and I won't be surprised if this contributes to legislation that restricts Saurons and e-bikes. And I wanted to make this video because of that because I want to show that not all Sauron riders think this is acceptable. If you see any other videos you'd like to see my response to, please email them to saronsterofficial at gmail.com. As always, thank you so very much for watching, and stay tuned.